upgrade of the late 2012 Mac Mini. So it's got four gigs of RAM, an i5 dual core, 500 gig hard drive. So I got this off eBay for around 250 pounds. So I'm gonna be upgrading the, the RAM, putting an SSD in, and another one terabyte hard drive. So I've got a dual, dual kit, so I should be able to get two drives in there. So I'm going to be following this tutorial and I'll be showing the results. I won't show you the whole tutorial because yeah, this will, this tutorial will show you how to do it a lot better than I will. So I've got, I've got my little kit and I'll show you the results. So this is an image of the Mac Mini taken apart. So I use some post-it notes for the individual steps. So when I um, go back and rebuild it, it should get back okay. Um, it's a pretty fairly simple process. So just have to follow the step-by-step -step guide on iFixit. And um, it's really useful to um, follow that guide because it said each and every step. So um, a fairly quick process. Cool, so after about two hours later, I've managed to put all the drives in the new Mac Mini. Um, just getting this flash and folder, so I need to put it into Internet Recovery. So we're in Internet Recovery now. Um, so I'll let you know what it's like once it's done. So I'm just reinstalling OS X Mountain Lion. So that's gonna probably take a fair amount of time. So I have to upgrade to Yosemite, so probably be a while. But I will update you afterwards. It's all all installed now. Really quick, so if I if I try and load something up, it just So it's really responsive, it's just the SSD is just really improved the machine and I'd recommend if anyone thinks about getting a Mac Mini in 2012 definitely worth getting and upgrade the SSD and you've got loads of space cool cheers thanks for watching if you've got any questions let me know in the comments below and I'll, I will answer them thanks a lot